destructive. I don't, we've had right. some minor flooding around. Yeah, but, we, yeah, we really have it good and we really need to count our blessings when it comes sure. to the weather activity that we get compared to not even across the country, but even just north of us in the same state. They're dealing with some treacherous conditions, record breaking snow. None of that happening here. In fact, uh, we're just looking about at about a few inches in our mountain areas. Here's a live look from downtown, but also uh, near the mountain area. And speaking of the mountain area near Mount Laguna, I was actually looking at the traffic right now around sunrise highway. That's the only road that you can take to get to the Mount Laguna area, and it looks like there are a lot of people headed that direction, and the traffic was really picking up. So just brace for crowds uh, if you're headed towards that direction to enjoy the inches of snow that we got overnight. Let's go ahead and take a look at some of those temperatures outside. We are hanging out in the 50s along the coastal communities, a little warmer in spots like downtown and IB. Meanwhile, 49 in Ramona and still in the 30s in spots like Julian and in Mount Laguna, 60s in the desert areas. So we had some light activity over the past few hours along the coast and through the inland areas. Very light activity, but as we uh, fast forward to 3.30 a.m., that's when the real heavy stuff arrives, and then that's pretty much going to be the story for the bulk of your Thursday. So as we give you a brief uh, brief highlights of the storm activity through Friday. Light and moderate showers today will turn into heavy rain this evening into tomorrow. Mountain snow this afternoon will transition to rain and we do have a flood watch issued by the National Weather Service through Thursday evening. Coastal areas today will top out in the mid to upper 50s. Tomorrow we're getting a little warmer, but then we'll dip back down to the 50s in time for your New Year's Eve day. Looking ahead to the weekend, pleasant conditions with plenty of sunshine makes a return. Mid 50s along the inland valleys and we'll stay in this trend for the next few days until we jump back to the 60s looking ahead to the weekend. Mountain highs in the mid to upper 30s because of those warm temperatures that snow level will rise as we get through the afternoon. Desert areas, mostly cloudy skies with a possibility of a shower or two and highs in the 60s. Jim. Vanessa,